When a website or application uses the WebAuthN protocol, it needs to register each one of the user's devices separately. So, for example, the user's smartphone, tablet, laptop, and desktop. Each device generates a private key and a public key. The private key never leaves the device and therefore is really hard to steal. Pass keys change that. With pass keys, each operating system vendor, or namely Apple, Google, and Microsoft, synchronizes the private key across multiple devices that run the same operating system. For instance, if a website has registered the user's iPhone for WebAuthN and the user has two other devices with the same Apple ID, the private key will roam automatically from the iPhone to these other devices. So when the user now goes to the website from any of these devices, the website can use the WebAuthN protocol to authenticate the user without the need to register all these other devices. The challenge with pass keys is that if the user's Apple ID, Google account, or Microsoft account is ever compromised, well, the attacker automatically achieves access to all the websites and application the user is registered to.